Mr. Danins, who was in Ondo State to get a first-hand information on the situation of health sector, admitted that Ondo State government has been able to effectively utilize aids and grants realized from the United States government to impact positively on the health needs of the people. Mr. Danins added that Governor Mimiko has set a great standard for the state by making medical services free for pregnant women and children under five years and urge other state governors to emulate Governor Mimiko's legacy. I heard a lot about uh, Bombo State and the work it's doing in its health system, particularly for uh, mothers and their children. Uh, it's great to see it myself now and to see that MBA program and all the other programs and see the impact that they're having. I've seen lots of healthy looking babies today uh, and uh, it's really exciting to see the uh, state doing so well, providing quality health care to the people. Also speaking, Ondo State Commissioner for Health, Dr. Dayo Adeonju, who accompanied Dr. Danis on the visits to head facilities in the state expressed delight that development partners are satisfied with the performance of the state government in the head sector and assured that the state government will continue to partner with the United States government and other development partners. For us as state government, this will only stimulate us to do a lot more. And of course, with the good work that is going on, you know, um, we're looking, working, doing everything uh, humanly possible to see how we can ensure uh, sustainability and consolidation of the good work that is going on. And of course, helping other uh, states and even helping other nations. Healthcare services have been free for pregnant women and children under five since the inception of the current administration in Ondo State. From Akure, the Ondo State capital, Omar Wajona reporting.